What is up all you beautiful people? It is I, Akemi. I am back here with a new video. So looking back at all my previous videos, they've been mostly about UPS. Those are the ones that have been gaining a lot of traction. And I'm looking back on it and I just realized it's been 8 months since I've been working at UPS. So now I just wanted to revisit it and put in my 5 benefits, top 5 that I receive when working at UPS. So I know there's a lot of negativity around going for my previous videos, I understand that, but I wanted to shed a little bit of positivity. Those videos weren't meant to be 100% negative, they're supposed to be neutral and look at both sides as a whole, but I wanted to shed some light into what's actually positive here at UPS. Number one has to be fitness. So working at UPS, you're lifting a ton of heavy boxes from one place to the other, whether you're unloading, loading, and the sort, even small sort, etc. You're going to inherently get fit. So if you aren't already going to the gym, then UPS will definitely be your replacement and will also help you get more fit in the long run. I still have the videos or the pictures of me being fit. You can see it right here. And that's exactly what happens when you start working at UPS. Number two is definitely benefits for part-time work. You're working at UPS, like 99.9% .9 of people, oh no, that's way too big. So 90% of people that go into UPS as a package handler work as a part-timer. And with the part-timer, you're part of the union, and this union will give you full-time benefits while you're working part-time at UPS. So you could be working from, let's say, 4 to 8, 4 p.m. to 8 p.m., but you'll get the same benefits as if somebody's working from 9 to 5. So if you're an independent contractor, this is very, very, very good news for you. So you can just look at it as like a gym workout rather than actually working for the money, you're working for the benefits. Number three, you're going to have a lot more energy after you work at UPS. So prior to work at UPS, I was a guy that didn't get too much energy during the day. With a solid night's sleep from 11 a.m. to 2 p.m. would be the peak of my energy levels and then afterwards they gradually declined and crashed around 6 p.m. Didn't feel too good, but after I went to UPS, I started realizing that, or noticing, that I got a lot more energy throughout every single day that I go with a lot of sleep or with adequate amount of sleep. And that goes back to the idea of fitness. So because I have my body moving around all these big boxes from one place to the other, I was being active. And that's what our human bodies are supposed to be. They're supposed to be active. And by doing this, you feel you'll have more energy during the day so you can get a lot more things done every day. Number four, you're gonna have a lot faster hands. I know this may not be an amazing benefit to have, but if you look at it from a holistic perspective, you work at UPS, you start with a PPH, well I personally started with around 700, 800 packages per hour. And afterwards, I worked my way up. I got up to 1,200, 1,300 packages per hour on average, assuming their average package weights. And with the speedy hands, also comes a better reaction time. Like when, let's say I'm working on, or I was sorting one package on my lane, and then I see my coworker next to me having a little bit of trouble with their package, I'd be able to react, run over, help them with the package really fast, and then run back to my lane and do mine really fast. So this can be helpful in a lot of situations, especially, let's say later on, if you aspire to be a chef or a person in the kitchen field, or let's say even in construction and engineering, you have fast and steady hands that can go a very, very long way. So number five, which is probably the most important benefit I received from working at UPS. As a disclaimer, not all of the above benefits and including this benefit may apply to you. Some people have different results, I'm just saying, what's my side out of it. Number five is confidence. After working at UPS and realized I was hitting milestone to milestone, especially with packages per hour, being able to do that really fast and interacting with a lot of different coworkers, I was able to improve my social networking skills and also become more confident in the process. I understand this may just apply for any job at all, but for UPS specifically, there's always this negative connotation towards it and I wanted to push it in the other direction and try to flip it on its head to explain to you guys that it's not just a place where dreams die, 
but it can be a place of learning, growing, and developing yourself as a person, and also possibly becoming a fitter and better looking person. I'm Akami. I have a lot of things in store for the next couple weeks. I know I've been out and haven't been uploading at all, but I'll be back soon. Stay beautiful, everyone. See ya. With these steady hands, but also fast hands,